I'm Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to expand expressions with complex numbers. The question is express 3 plus 2i to the power of 4 as x plus iy. Now whenever you know we have binomial powers we could always use Pascal's triangle or combination right. So Pascal's triangle let me just draw one here begins with once then one spread on the right and left side and inside terms are sum of previous two so here sum of one one will be two and on the left and right side we keep getting ones right so one plus two is three two plus one is three one on the side and you'll also see that there is a symmetry right so one three plus one is four three plus three is six three plus one is four and one so you this expression now this is the fourth row for us which represents the coefficients for expanding a binomial term right so we'll have five terms we could write 3 plus 2i to the power of 4 as equal to so here the first term is 3 the second is 2i the coefficient will be 1 powers will be sum of powers will be 4 so I could write this as 3 to the power of 4 plus next time the coefficient has to be 4 right so we'll write 4 times 3 to the power of 1 less than 4 and the second term which is 2i for us will have power of 1 now plus 6 will give us 3 square and square of 2i plus now this power will reduce by 1 right let me write dot here so we have plus 6 times 3 times 2i cube right and the last term will I'm sorry this should be 4 sorry this coefficient 4 the last term will be 2i to the power of 4 coefficient is 1 I'm not writing that not required so what we get here is 3 to the power of 4 you can use the calculator uh, at this stage 3 to the power of 4 is 9 times 9 81 let me write 81 here now here we get 4 times 3 cube let us do it in two steps which is 27 times 2i okay plus 6 times 3 square is 9 square of this is 4i square is it okay now the next term here is plus 4 times 3 is 12 2 cube is 8i cube right plus 2 to the power of 4 that means 16 i to the power of 4 correct okay so that gives us 81 now we can multiply these numbers 4 times 2 is 8 8 times 7 is 56 5 8 times 2 is 8 and 5 is 13 i i square is minus 1 so we get minus here and then we can have 6 times 9 right so let's do 6 times 9 so 9 6 times 4 is 24 let's multiply that by 9 9 times 4 36 3 9 times 2 18 so 216 okay 216 i square minus 1 now in this case 12 times 8 so we get plus well i cube is minus i i should write minus here we'll put minus i here as you know uh, let me rewrite here i square is minus 1 i cube is minus 1 times i which is minus i and i to the power of 4 is 1 so we are going to use this also while expanding is it okay now 12 times 8 8 times 2 is 16 6 1 96 right i cube so i cube is minus i so i'll write minus i this time i to the power of 4 is 1 so we get plus 16 do you see that so we have two terms with i and others are constant real numbers we'll add them up so we have 81 this is plus 136i minus 216 here we have minus 96i plus 16 right so we can combine the numbers and uh, and the imaginary parts so we have 81 plus 16 which is 797 
will take away 97 from 216. So we have 216 take away 97. So that gives us 9, 10 gives us 1, 119. So we get here minus, this is negative number, right? So we did kind of reverse, minus 119. As far as the items are concerned, we'll take away 96 from 136. 6 take away, so we have plus, this plus is bigger. 13 take away, 9 is 4, so we have 40. 40i. So the expression 3 plus 2i to the power of 4 can be written as minus 119 plus 40i. So let me rewrite the answer which is 3 plus 2i to the power of 4 is equals to minus 119 plus 40i. Right. So in this case I just did some rough calculations. I would like you to solve this using a calculator and correct if I am wrong somewhere that is possible okay I'm Anil Kumar you can always share and subscribe my videos thank you and all the best